What's going on, it's Johnny, and welcome back to episode number four of the Valheim series. We are in our second little base here. Uh, it's the morning. Unfortunately, not actually, not unfortunately. It's great. We're going to go ahead and go in towards the um, Black Forest here. I just wanted to see if. Wait, what do I need to do these? I need flint. Let's go ahead and get some flint, actually. Let's go ahead and start this off strong here. Grab some flint and get that stuff going. For that. <laughs> yep. That's how it is sometimes. I think we need like. Mm, I'm gonna say we probably need a bunch. Maybe like half a stack, probably, just to kind of finish off the thing. Let's go ahead and make sure. I see you, bud. We're gonna get you out of there, though. From there. Thank God there's flint around these areas. So the last episode of you guys were right here, though. Uh, we finished the first boss. And we did our first troll. So that was a pretty productive little episode, actually. We did a lot of there. So this episode is probably more chill. We're going to kind of go into the Black Forest a little bit deeper today because I want to try to get copper and uh, tin so we can start making bronze stuff. How many we got? Eight? I think we need, what, five for that? Uh, okay, so I need 15 there, and I need 10 there, so I need to get 25 total. I guess we could just run back to the house, but it might just be easier just doing this, to be honest with you. I actually just ended up back at the house trying to get plant. We got 6 or 17, but we do have some in the chest here, so we're going to grab it. I think it's this one. Nope, it is this one. And that should give us just enough to be done. I think we can probably actually look. Wood, and we need leather scraps and deer hide. I guess we got, I mean, I guess we really don't need it. Technically. Huh. Nah, I think we're gonna I think we're gonna bypass that. I don't really think we're gonna need it to be honest. How much we have four honeys. Go ahead and get these going again. We could still make uh five more actually, but we're gonna kinda hold off on these because eventually we're gonna move them anyway, so we will just let all of this shit go here. Actually, what I've been wanting to do is get rid of this stupid ass rock right in front of our base. It just randomly just generated right there. I don't think it was here in the first episode. So it just eventually just spawned in right in front. And I've been wanting this thing gone for so long now. Come on. There we go. One more little small rock here. Perfect. All right. Go ahead and throw all this extra stuff down here. Throw that down. Got some rocks. Like so. Plant, I don't think we're gonna need. We have so much freaking food, man. Honestly, like it's kind of crazy how much food we do have. We have 11 there. How much, can we? Can, okay. Let's do that. Do that. Close our door here. I don't really, yeah, we don't really need to put wood in here. Let's go ahead and go back. We're gonna call it there for the first base. I wanna try to really do a pretty big adventure uh, deeper into the Black Forest. I know I said this earlier, but the whole goal of this today is to get copper, to get tin, kind of explore, look around and see if we can find some burial stuff. Maybe not go into them right away, but just enough to kind of know where we are. And, yeah, go from there, really. Just kind of, like, grinding out stuff. I'm gonna do a lot of the grinding offline, but I do still want to go in the Black Forest and show everybody what's all in there. If you guys have not been there, you at least know what to expect. So, but this series really isn't meant to be too long, but I don't want it to be too short. I kind of want it to be, like, a walkthrough, so everyone knows what to expect and what to do without really showing the, two, the true grindiness of the game, but also showing the true grindiness of the game. Kind of, like, find that nice middle area. You'll kind of know what I mean. 
our issue right now is our stuff does okay. It just doesn't do too well with a lot of them. If that makes sense. Like, it just doesn't do too well with, like, six or seven of them. Okay, let's throw all this extra stuff. I think we have a ten one. Is it this one? Yes. We have a little fourteen there. Just kind of control click all of this extra stuff here. If it can go in, it, I'm gonna put it in. Throw that down here, like so. We can always take this shit back to our main house, but for right now, it's gonna do. Let's make sure we can. I sleep. I can sleep. Ah, maybe I shouldn't have slept right there. That's all right. We'll wait till the next morning. Hopefully, it's not raining. Raining in this day in this game is insane. All right, we're back at it like a crack addict. Hey, okay, bada bing. Uh, here we go. Go ahead, go down. I want to uh, go back to that troll area that we found. It had some a bunch of wood here. If we go ahead and grab this wood, take it back. Yeah, I think we're gonna go ahead and do that. All right, I just got the wood, and uh, look what I found. Right up here, tucked away behind these little trees, it's carrot seeds. So we're gonna go ahead and grab that because now we can get a farm started. This is gonna be really, really helpful for us to get some food. Start grinding out the out that. Okay, let's go back down this way because this is where we found the troll earlier. Uh, it was right down here, I think. I think we kept going along this area and it was up that way, tucked away. We did see a plate. There we go. There was a bunch of like torn down. Looks to be boats. I'm gonna grab this tin though. Go ahead and get this going while we can. Let's go along this way to make sure we didn't miss any. Don't think so. Oh, there's some up here. Two of them, actually. Really gotta make sure we have we use our stamina buffs and make sure we eat so we get our stamina up because it does make a big, big difference. We're making a lot of noise. I'm hoping none of this stuff spawns and it starts attacking us. This is the biggest issue in this game is uh, honestly just things spawning in when you're trying to do shit. You're making so much noise. So let's go ahead and go back to the house because we have enough weight. Really? This is what I'm talking about. I just defeated some of you people. The thing about these things here 112 pounds for that tin. It's kind of crazy. Put this down. We have full, almost a full stack. Alright, we're back in the black forest here. I just want to see if we can find some. Burial grounds and some copper. <clears throat> I'm gonna really try not to deal with trolls if we can, but I can't promise that because they do just kind of pop up at random. You're not really paying attention, so get some of these carrots. Really gonna help us there. Try to get as many as those as we can. Um, just keep going deeper and deeper until it becomes a problem. There's blueberries here, really stock up on everything in Black Forest if we can. Really not sure. I think this is just regular stuff. Hmm. There we go. Got something down here. Problem with this is that it's gonna be is it's gonna be skeletons, and they are freaking douchebags. Make sure we're eat we're we're we're, we're uh Continuing eating here. Can't words at the moment. Uh, let's go see if we can take a couple of these out. I want to use all my easy, will ya? Here they come. Perfect. We're getting hit from the top here. So see if we can take this guy out. Really? 
One more. And maybe two. You mother effer. Bada bing. Okay, we did get some bones. Um, I want to see if maybe there's a chest in here. No. Maybe up top. I'm thinking. So I can grab all of this extra stuff. Nothing up here besides that. Alright, cool. I'm glad I wasted my freaking energy on that. Let's, try, let's just grab this wood just in case we do need it. Alright, let's make sure we can eat. We did get some skeleton bones, which is pretty big. We will take that to the bank. It'll eventually help us uh, upgrade our club and stuff. Copper deposit right here. Okay, let's make a, a point of this here. Copper. In the wrong buttons. Come on. You gotta get, really gotta get into here. How much weight can we do? About 200 pounds. So I'm thinking we can probably do... Just a little bit here. Just to get enough that we can go back to the house and drop it off. Alright, I couldn't get all of it. We, uh... My, my, my pickaxe broke, so... We're gonna just... Head on back to the... Area here. I wish there was, like, a time. Would love a time. To see, like, you know, is it is it almost done with uh, the day or what? Et cetera, et cetera. Let's go ahead and go back. I'm thinking it's probably really close to being day or nighttime, so we could probably sleep. We got some jack wagons coming. I heard you. There you are. I don't think he saw us. Should be okay. House is just right up here on the side here. Yeah, we did get some copper though, which is really, really good. Uh, copper. Got some wood. Did get some bones. Can I do anything with the bones? Don't think so. I think we need five. Yeah. So we'll get some more of those eventually. Alright, it's the next day. We're going right back at it. Because, uh, we really need this to get... Right now, we're just at the point where we gotta grind at the Black Forest. Copper, tin, things like that. And so, we'll do one episode where we grind stuff out, and then... We'll kind of go from there. Eventually, we're gonna make, be able to make a cart, which I'm pretty, pretty excited about. Which will help us, um, get a lot of stuff. I just hear a troll. I only have a lot of arrows. I swear I heard a troll marching around. I'm gonna try to I literally try not to do that because them are pieces of crap. Hey, okay. hopefully this is all. Oh, this is just everything they drop. I had to defeat some people. Alright, we're back at it. I guess technically we could probably... I didn't bring enough wood. Dang it. We'll just do this one more time, and then we'll head back, and then we'll we'll come back, and then we can always make a little thing so we can continue getting more. But we do have it marked on our map now, so I'm not really too worried about it. We're not really too far away either. Just like right up this way. But could you imagine if we didn't make this area here? We had to go all the way back here. Look how big that would have been. So, I'd recommend always making little huts if you if you do play this game. All right, we're actually gonna throw up one of these. If I can put it anywhere here. It doesn't really matter where I put it. I just want to put it somewhere. We're gonna make a chest, just a small one. I guess I'll just put it right next to it, huh? Maybe? Yeah. Perfect. Uh, let's put uh, all this in here. 
We do got some core wood, which is nice. And what we're using this for is... Actually, we can't use that yet. Uh, I need the fucking wood. Okay, we're gonna make this little hut here. Uh, we could probably get rid of this. That. And we're just gonna throw... This on it. That on it. That on it. And then put these sides on it. If I do something like that. Maybe. Perfect. And go this side here. Boom. Now we should be able to use this. Boom. Yeah, we can. Get all this going. Throw all that in. Throw our wood in. Just like so. And yeah, we're just going to continue just getting this copper deposit here because a lot going on. And then we're gonna after we get this copper deposit, we're probably gonna go ahead and see if we can find a burial thing, clear that out, grab what we need to do, make a smelter, and then that'll be an episode, I think. It's a lot to do yet, but I'm really just gonna grind this copper out here. You don't need to see all of it, but we're just gonna sit here and keep hitting it until it gives us stuff. That's literally all we're doing. Looks like there's some stuff inside this mountain here. Can you go down farther? Can. Give me all of it. This freaking node is gi effing gigantic, dude. It, like, it goes deeper into the, uh, the mountain here. I mean, look at this. Look how big this thing is. It stop right here. It does. Dude, good lord. I would like to just continue to... Figure all of this out here. If I can cut this out and then might underneath it, it might just bust. And then, it, then we'll have a shoot ton of freaking copper. It'll take some time. I'm thinking it might take a little bit less time because each each hit to get copper is like five or six hits, and we're running through it within just one hit of the uh, stuff surrounding it. So. That's the plan for right now, I think. Okay, you see how they get this big chunk here? If we cut into this here, depending how far down it goes, we should be able to just cut it out. And it should just crumble down. And here's one here. Like that. Looks like it's stuck to that one. I can get up into it, maybe. Let's see here, this here's one that's probably gonna be in the way. Okay, so if we can cut this bottom half out, we should be decent. Looks like... I don't think it's attached to anything. This tree, maybe? Let's see how... If I get this tree out, will it eventually start? I think it's because this is in the way. Okay, let's go back up to the top here. It's all stone. I just want to show you what I'm trying to do here. Go up here, let it become dark. I would like to get this done though. Before it does get dark. Come in here. A little bit more into this. If we can get this piece here out of the way, it should start crum crumbling down. That's my theory. Is it that one, maybe? 
Go deeper. There we go. So it is just floating here. Yeah, there's literally it won't it won't crumble. There's it, there's nothing holding it. Literally nothing. Unless it thinks it's this that's holding it. I can probably get that out of the way, maybe. Yeah, there is literally nothing holding it. Not one effing thing. Go ahead and do this. How much weight we have? 286? How many can I hold, I wonder? Let's try one. But each one's 10 pounds, so I can do two more. Oh, I can do way more than that. Okay, we'll take four out of this. I went the wrong way, that's why it's all weird. Okay, let's do five. Do five more. And let's take these rocks out. Do a little bit more. Let's do five more from the chest. Five more from the chest. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and head back to the house here. We can sleep away. Now yeah, we just gotta go back home, sleep, and yeah, just kind of keep grinding this copper out. So it actually looks like these copper nodes actually the brute right here. We're in the meadows now, so we don't gotta worry about them. That brute, man, those things are insane. Looks like he's gonna come to us any- no. Yeah, he's coming. Come on over here, big boy. Look at that. Gotta keep doing this. Uh, maybe. Got one of these douchebags out of the way. But I didn't want to go to the, towards that, um... Alright, let's go ahead and run into this area here. Go ahead and sleep. That needs a fire. I have no freaking wood. I do now. Sleep before a freaking enemy starts spawning. All right, everybody, this is gonna be the end of episode number four of the Valheim series. Uh, my dumbass forgot to do an outro, so here we are doing an after. I right, was get to it. Make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and share your friends. Always, guys, my name is Johnny. I'll be seeing you guys in episode number five. Um, this episode, like I said, it really wasn't anything too crazy. Just kind of showing you where copper, tin, things like that are in the in the, um, in the world in the Black Forest. Uh, like I said before, though, this series is mostly just showing stuff and where to get it and how to get it um but kind of removing the real grindiness of the game so if i come in and i have a ton of stuff already kind of found in a chest it's because i went and grinded it out because uh there's a lot of nodes copper and i don't really feel like showing you every single one that i go through because it's really just walking up to it hitting it with the pickaxe grabbing it putting it in a chest keep going keep going keep going once I completed it, grab it, take it back to the house, do that a couple times, go to the next node. Or go to the shore and get 10, come back to the house. It's constant repeating the process until you have enough to actually continue on in the journey of Valheim. So, if you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, and I'll see you guys next episode. Bye!